Greetings, Geeshlings. Geesh Prime here with my live reaction. Late live reaction to everything because I've been sick. Still not great, but better. <coughs> that seems to be the full extent of what's left in me. Let's see here. Chain Soldier, Chapter 110. Alright, let's see here. We've got Tenka and uh, Fabuki leaving as the 9th and 7th units left Shangri-La. The seventh unit will uh, train by themselves until Bell and the eighth unit, aka Bell the Deceiver, until they arrive. Give it a try. Okay. That's not a new form. What, what buddy? Hmm. But each one's growth. So you've. Oh wait, that is. The one for her. Forgot what it's called though. This big old Goliath looking dude. Let's see here. We'll do a wide attack. Wide area attack. Wide area. You threw a rock. <laughs> right. Oh. You just threw pebbles. Okay, you freaking beast titan knockoff. The ranged attack looked quite impre quite effective. I can't talk now. I thought of many possible ways or uses for it. Gigantifying to prepare these boulders was the right thing. If I also gigantify and throw them, we'll have even more hands to use. Don't you think this form has a use in defending our base? You may defend fodder with those, but it will uh, mean nothing against tougher foes. With the upcoming battles in mind, that would be the greatest uh, weakness. And for that, I want to try using the same killer technique you did. Oh, what, what, Hinarin? Hinarin. Focus your power in your arm and try punching. Uh, w will I be able to do that? <laughs> Look at your body. I'm sure a jaw dropper will come out. What? Alright, so he does it. I'll try doing the same thing as branding. Hmm. And he punches. Oh my. Okay. It went flying. I I did it. <laughs> its power might even be higher if you stick both arms out and spin them. I see. Uh, it definitely seems possible. Uh, make sure to remember that. Alrighty. Uh oh. Reward time. She's in a bathing suit. A reward dressed like this seems to... Strike your fancy too, Yuki. Okay, they they kiss. He grabs her by the way. Isn't the way Yuki kisses just way too good. But but I can't put up a front and force myself onto Yuki. He has to come to me of his own volition. Well he he's starting to dangle his little fingers in there. Mm -hmm. uh, but that's a really diff uh, but that's really difficult for him, I think. Due to his earnest nature of his. Well, real earnest, just a really, just, good lord, how far in your fingers are you going into her flesh. And I love him for it. The next day. Alright. Beast power. You're using beast power. That That's a move I wasn't thinking from, uh... Hamari like that. Let's see here. I, I was kind of under the impression that it they had to be in somewhat close proximity, but, you know, I figured because Shangri-La is its own dimension that that made it even less likely so you had just whoever was there. I guess not. Maybe she doesn't have the limits that I originally thought or just don't remember how that worked. 
She really doesn't get focused that much, so that's probably why I forget. <clears throat> All killing. What? She duplicated as well. And, but, got blasted away. Eh. It's not eh, going the same way as it did during the banquet. Looks like you've gotten to a point where you can use multiple abilities during real combat. Ah, okay, I was about to say, I was like, that ain't one of her abilities. Mm -hmm. I'm counting on you, Hamari. Yes. Okay, so she's able to get to two abilities. Yuki has gotten to where he can channel energy, like kind of a key charged fist. Or into other parts of his body as well, but... Hmm. Shushu doesn't really seem to have much going for her. But we seem to be focusing on her next. You're going next, Shushu. And she punches the air. She kicks the air. She stomps down on the ground. A gigantification with a three-minute time limit. Seems to work well. I feel my entire body swelling with powers in this limited mode. Hmm. Paradigm shift is an ability that is great at continuous usage. You'd be sacrificing that, but <clears throat> I'll use my ability the same as I as always against fodder, and then switch to the limited mode against tougher opponents. I'll be able to handle anything that comes. You've evolved your power to adapt to future battles. Very well done, Shushu. I've made up my mind to not lose in neither love nor war. Oh. By the way, where are Yuki and, um, Hamarian? Hmm. That Hamarian just is weird. Hamarian's currently using Yuki. What? She did in the moment. A chance I showed up. I let my guard down just because the chiefs had left. Hmm. Mm, excuse me. Giving her a foot massage? Kiss my legs. <laughs> it's like, he kissed her legs. I know we have to train our usage of slave. And, yep, they're right there in the coochie. But this is indecent. Uh-oh. We're seeing the door. So, Bell the Betrayer has arrived. Let's see. Who did she bring along? Yeah, I don't recognize either one of them, but she got big titties. <laughs> There's the eighth captain, of course. I mean, she's the one that's got to let you in and out. Then you've got these two newcomers who I don't know who they're supposed to be. And then... Bell. Bell. Back there. So, hmm. I do like that they're progressing with their abilities. Uh, Hamari probably being the more useful of those abilities. Because she's actually able to use more than one now. Which is a great advantage. <coughs> Considering it's a very rare thing for anyone, unless you have a very specific ability that's allowing you to manipulate that or you're bestowed an ability or something by the gods, something like that. Yeah, no, really multiple abilities is a thing. So, nice. Shushu was a little... I don't quite get how you limited it to up your power? Okay. I mean, I guess I've seen that kind of thing before, but it just doesn't look that impressive. But it could just be how it's being utilized in that scene, is what I'm assuming. And, uh, yeah, that's really the only two that did anything. Hmm. The rock strategy is kind of eh. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah uh, I think that's about all I have to say about this chapter not much really happened it's training in Shangri-La and now the enemy has arrived 
We'll have to wait and see where things go. But uh, let me know your own thoughts and opinions. Anything I missed, misunderstood, please let me know down below. Again, I'm sorry I got sick, so all my videos got delayed horribly. <clears throat> so I'm trying to get all of them out today. But I probably won't. But either way. <clears throat> so, yeah. Links down below. All that good stuff. I stream on Twitch where I do gaming, and I'll tweet out when I go live. Part of the One Punch Man podcast on Grim Reaper's channel, so go check that out. We, that should be coming out soonish, tomorrow sometime, so we'll see. But uh, anyway, later days. Until next time, Keishlings. <sighs> Tired.